Southern California, the home of Hollywood glitz. While the rich and famous dress to impress, their cars need to stretch to impress. Some of these glossy monsters top out at 32 feet, the length of a city bus. So when it comes to making the ultimate stretched limo, how do they do it? You can't just walk into a dealership and buy a stretch limo off the lot. If you want extra length in your limo, you've got to get it tailor-made. And you start by taking a brand new $38,000 car like this, somewhere like this Laguna Hills Chop Shop, so they can cut it in half. Just cutting this car in half would be easy. The real challenge is making sure everything works when they put it back together. The first major problem is the essential cabling, brake lines, suspension, and electric. If they aren't extended, the front wheels might stop, but the rear wheels will keep turning. So to give the lengthy limo enough stopping power, the Chop Shop team very carefully sever and bundle up the 650 feet of wires so they can be spliced and extended with new cable. When slicing through a brand new luxury car, they only get one shot to get it right. One small mistake will send the team back to the dealership with a $38,000 hole in their wallet. So the car's body is carefully marked out with tape along the joints and panels to show where it is safe to cut. A circular saw slices through the thin roof panels, but that's not nearly enough blade for the Chrysler's tough internal structure. So they bring in an 800-watt reciprocating power saw to slice through the sides of the car and into its body. Now the car is in half, but it needs to be 11 and a half feet longer than it was when it came out of the factory. That means creating an entire new middle section from scratch. But if that much metal's left hanging in midair, the whole vehicle will crack in half the first time it rolls over a bump in the road. The solution is a pair of galvanized steel girders to create a solid framework to support the new middle section. But unless these two girders are exactly the same length, the car won't drive in a straight line, leaving the new limo unstable and dangerous. So the crew has to measure the girders more than once to check that they're identical to within 1.5 millimeters. The framework is perfect, but this luxury limo is still looking a little sparse. If this car is going to hold together with an extra ton of metal hanging in the middle, there's a whole lot of work to do. Over five days, the crew will add vertical support beams, upgrade the brakes, and install two more extra thick suspension springs to cope with the extra weight. Then reconnect all the suspension and brake cables and electrics. Now it needs to be put together, and it has to be able to withstand some of the rowdiest riders. So to make this car even tougher than it is tasteful, every beam, joint, and seam is precision welded. Of course, half the fun of riding in these super stretch machines is looking out at the people looking at you just in case you're someone famous. But ordinary car windows come up short, 11 and a half feet short. These 13-foot panes have to be individually pre-ordered for each car from a specialist supplier. These hunks of glass weigh over 65 pounds each and will set you back $1,300, which doesn't include the installation charge. Now the team has a 32-foot long car on their hands, but you can't call it a luxury limo until it's got door-to-door -door carpeting and a comfy interior. So the crew has to put the drills down and start pimping out the inside. They turn 750 square feet of cowhide into a high-class party place, complete with mood lighting 
and a mini fridge. After a surprisingly restrained paint job and some tender polishing, all it needs is neon to make it the next big thing in Hollywood. Still to come, how do they use some of the tallest trees in the world to make fine paper? Join us after the break to find out how. They've done it again. DirecTV will soon have the capacity for over 200 HD channels. Oh, for a second there, I thought you said 200. I did. Son of a... What is it with those guys? For a future of over 200 HD channels, call 1-800-DIRECTV. Next Thursday on an all-new Science of the Movies, chronicle the creatures of Narnia and discover the magic that brings them to life. What we've done is to recreate the muscles moving underneath the skin. Oh, my gosh. This is so realistic. Then meet...